Introduction. Every constant reader remembers the first time they delved into the delicious horror of Stephen King. For me, Meg, it was finding a paperback of Carrie and my parents' stack of books. I asked my mom if she thought I should give it a try. She thought it would be the perfect introduction for me to Mr. King. And as usual, my mom was right. I was on the cusp of adulthood at age 14, and like Harry, I had a million worries. Unlike Carrie, I couldn't move objects with my mind or take murderous revenge on my classmates. After reading about the telekinetic teen girl, I was a lifelong constant reader, joining Stephen King on adventures of both unbelievable horror and surprisingly tender heartache. For Kelly, it was watching The Shining with her dad in first grade. Having been introduced to horror movies the year before, Stephen King became her new favorite fascination and she sought out his books as she got older. When we began research for this book, it became clear that we were going to learn about science, folklore, and literary influences. Yet, we ended up coming to understand the author himself more than anything. Join us, fellow constant readers, on a journey into the creative, dynamic world of Stephen King. Leave behind reality for the modest towns of Derry, Castle Rock, and Salem's Lot. Traverse the magical landscape of Midworld. Because as you well know, there are other worlds than these.